With the CircuitPython Parsec today, I wanted to show how you can set up the boot.py file so that your CircuitPython device won't show up as a CircuitPython drive or in the REPL when you don't want it to. So you often want it to. You often want a CircuitPython device like this uh, QD Pi that I'm using here to show up as a drive so you can drag code onto it and interact with it really easily. But sometimes, such as the case where you've built yourself a little HID uh, USB number pad like I did here, you don't want that showing up as a drive because you're using it, it's plugged into a computer all the time, and unless you're specifically going in to change something, most of the time you want it to, to sit still, not show up, not accidentally copy files to it, and so on. So to cut down on the confusion, you can add a file called the boot.py file. I'm importing storage and USB CDC. I'm also importing board and digital I.O. What I'm doing is I'm setting up one pin as a button or a switch, and when that is pulled down, I can tell this to run the storage disabled USB drive and USB CDC dot disable commands. That'll only happen when it's restarted if that button is held down. Or in this case, what I have is a little pin that I've put in place here and a jumper. So what you'll notice is right now, my CircuitPython uh, drive is running. My little cutie pie is showing a little rainbow here. And you can see in the finder, I have a CircuitPy drive showing up. That's this one right here. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to set down this jumper and you'll see that when the code is running, it's just running this rainbow. Same code is going to run when I restart it. It's just not going to show up as a CircuitPy drive. So I'm just going to hit the reset button. It's going to restart, but this time you'll notice the CircuitPy drive disappeared and it's not coming back but it's still working. It's still running the same exact code. It's just the very first thing it executed is this boot.py. And when it sees that, it runs through whatever code is in there. In this case, the code is telling it, don't show up as a CircuitPy drive, don't show up in the REPL or on a serial port. And that is how you can use boot.py to tell a CircuitPython drive to not show up when you don't want it to. And that is your CircuitPython Parsec.